Hi, hello, YouTube. This is my uh, project, which is I'm not um, plan to uh, build, but accidentally I was looking in YouTube and I have seen many of the uh, DIY. Uh, chopper bicycle and I look around my shop and I found a lot of the uh, the part that you have it here I have the the front which is a BMX I cut it up and I have the uh, uh, 13 inch wheel and uh, which is I built for the other project but never used of the uh, and now I have to build. I built this one is a couple of days. So I draw um, the, the frames. And I don't have the pipe bending. And I think it's a very good example for the uh, many of the uh, DIY, which is, you know. Uh, many people don't have the the welder machine, welding machine, and I have idea because um, the nearby my shop have the one shop they do uh, what they call it the kind of laughing style uh, um, furniture, which is uh, use the uh, galvanite pipe in the black color so I build this one so let's get to the detail today I finish on this one is the hydraulic pump and this is a 13 inch wheel which is for the compact car and you can see on the side I built it two of them and that one is for a previous project which is already done and this one is um, you know and uh, many people are like uh, critic about how gonna be strong. Basically, it's like a bicycle. I uh, idea is a bicycle, a chopper, and uh, and the idea is I plan to have this the hub wheel front, but you know, you order the part from AliExpress. And you probably like wait for a month until you forgot. <laughs> so, and uh, I have an urge to try. So that's why I put the really simple motor. It's this a uh, two wide, which is a black call. It's uh, the brass motor, which is a ten. Oh, sorry, one thousand watt, thirty six volt. And I use this, and. Um, this is a gold card um, sprocket ATX teeth and uh, you know the rest of this is a one and a half inch pipe and some people said how the thread gonna be uh, perfect I said no it's not when you you cannot control when they do the thread from this one the top so I have to drill and I use the stainless steel Hex nuts, so hex screw, all of them, and I use this uh, fiberglass seat, which is very comfortable. <laughs> so basically, you, you know, you sit. Basically, you sit. It's not a ride like a shopper. It sit. It's like you can enjoy cruising around. You know. And I decide perfect in my leg because I have, I am six feet tall, so I have extra length from the regular people here in Thailand. So I have to build a little bit longer. So that's why you see here. That's why you see here. It look like a attach. So I have the screw here, big screw underneath here, so you can see it. And uh, I have a big screw. To connect and I have one two three which is you can slightly adjust and somebody like you know 
a little bit shorter than me you want if someday I sold it I sell it and they might you know be able to adjust but and I plan to have this one hook up with the the part which I have a lot in here you can put perfect complete but this is what I uh, meant to do on this project to show how easy for regular DIY or regular maker and uh, to enjoy build a bike okay so the next video gonna be maybe a couple days for on the ground outside because now it's already dark here and I just finished the hydraulic bike install for the you know the air bubble air and the uh, okay then thank you bye bye